I'm here today with Abby and Jillian from Swiss Club and they have an exciting announcement. Thank you, Arielle. I'm Jillian from Strong Women Impacting Society Club and I'm here to talk about an event on Saturday at St. Paul's Methodist Church basement at 7 p.m. called Her Story. This year's theme is a celebration of love and we're going to have a group of women talk about their experiences with feminism and why they love themselves or other people. We have a speaker from the Advocacy Center named Lynn Sack as well as um, no local rapper Samus. Abby? Uh, the suggested donation is $7 and all proceeds are benefiting the Advocacy Center. Last year we raised over $1,000 and we're hoping to double that this year. Um, in addition to the presentations, we have many uh, small activities and if that isn't reason enough to come, we also have desserts from local favorites such as Purity and Dolce Delight. Hope to see you there. Good morning, IHS. This is a little red in the morning, brought to you by me, Danny Sagliano, along with my Kanye-loving friend, Owen Hartman. So, Owen, uh, I have a good idea about who's going to start the show. What is it? How about we have a rock-paper-scissors battle? A war, perhaps. Yes. Okay, ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Man, I guess rock really does beat paper, huh? Today is Friday, May 29th, a day three. For lunch today, we are having grilled cheese. Senior prom will be held on June 6th at the Farmer's Market from 8 to 11 p.m. The event will feature local band, The Blind Spots. Tickets will be sold for $30 today, but the price will rise to $35 between June 1st and the 4th. You can buy your tickets in the cafeteria during all lunch periods, and you must have a signed dance contract. Today is the last day of the school store's sale. Crew neck t-shirts are only $3. Ladies t-shirts are $4, and long sleeve t-shirts are $6. Hoodies are only $18, and drawstring backpacks are $5. The school store is open from 11.30 to 12.30 each day in the cafeteria. Do you believe in equality? Would you like to learn more about what Swiss is all about? Looking for some delicious drinks and desserts? Come to Her Story this Saturday, May 30th at St. Paul's United Methodist Church at 7 p.m. for a night of speaking performances, music, and delicious food. All profits go to the local advocacy center. See you there. Now here's Cameron bringing you a little bit of weather. Thank you, Danny. Today we started out with some fog in the area, but it will warm up as we will actually get highs in the mid-80s. And then tomorrow we're going to have a stormy afternoon as well as Sunday a stormy morning as the temperature plummets down. Sunday we have a high in the low 60s. Monday we're going to see much of the same thing as we did on Sunday. With the possibility of rain, the temperature will slowly start to rise again. And we should be back into the warmer weather by Tuesday. And now, here's Owen with the news. Thanks, Cameron. It's good to see your face again, IHS. On May 11th, Justin Way, a, su a suicidal man, was shot by the police. Justin's wife had previously called for a non-emergency hotline for him to try and get some help. Later that night, two police officers came to Justin's house and killed him. Justin's wife had stated, however, that he was nonviolent the entire time. Also, recently, FIFA has come under scandal for accepting bribes regarding their World Cup locations, including upwards of 10 million from South Africa in 2010. And now, time for some Kanye news. Kanye West has joined Kim Kardashian's game. Kanye has now entered the virtual world, or at least that's what fans of Keeping Up With The Kardashians have been led to believe. Glue Games posted a picture on Twitter of new characters who would be joining the next update, and Mr. West seems to be in it. Now here's Zach with some sports. Thank you, Owen. I will have updates on track and field sectionals tomorrow. Now back to you, Danny. This is a little run in the morning, saying goodbye. Okay. <laughs>